another story by Dr. Seth Biswas, Forest, Forestry Professor of Dolphin PG Institute, to say about me, I'm called Bahinia. And uh, autobiographically, uh, Bahinia are uh, named after uh, my leaf. Uh, you can see my leaf. I have leaf which is lobed. So, what happened? A uh, great uh, plant taxonomist, come uh, geological taxonomist, uh, Dr. Linnaeus, uh, he, he found in me the names of two more botanists named John Caspar um, and, uh, and another one named Gaspar uh, Gaspard uh, Bahin. So John Caspar, John and Caspar, both of them. Uh, you can see, uh, say one was named John Caspar, uh, John and Caspar, John Bahin and Caspar Bahin. Both the brothers, but they had a difference of uh, 20 years. So when Linnaeus got this sample, he uh, named after these two uh, brothers and uh, they were the jointly, so, so it was named as uh, uh, Bahinia uh, by, by Linnaeus. In fact, uh, uh, um, for naming the plant, if we do go, uh, the credit uh, goes uh, uh, to both Casper uh, and uh, uh, John uh, Bahins for binomial nomenclature that helped uh, Linnaeus to uh, make uh, his, uh, uh, you know, one of the most important principles of uh, plant uh, naming. Well, let me come back, Dr. Biswas. Are you seeing it? Please see. I have got a pretty flower, and with the characteristics of this, I am called uh, Bahinia tomentosa. All right, um, uh, Miss Bahinia, I understand about uh, why you are called um, Bahinia, but why you are called Bahinia tomentosa? Well, Dr. Sas Biswas, I tell you what Linnaeus found in me and the, in my parts, and the parts, you know, if you if if somebody touches, it find a very light, hairy, uh, thickly matted, and that is what uh, you know botanist call or dendrologist uh, call it uh, tomentos. So if you your if your students come and touch it, may feel. And the hair on it, and that is what the name came as uh, Tomentosa. Therefore, I am called Bahinia Tomentosa. I from I come uh, from uh, you know African continent, and is cultivated throughout um, the uh, the world for my pretty flowers and landscaping, as uh, and the bush around the apartment, such as in your place. Uh, prestige palms where I can find a very healthy life. I touch upon the uh, you know fresh air and the sunlight and uh, the moment uh, you know uh, some time passes then bees will come to pollinate me and that's how we'll give you give you some some fruits. When you go back to Dolphin Institute you can carry some of the seeds to grow there and I'll come out to decorate it, and people will also come to know why I am called Bahinia. Thank you, Miss Bahinia.